Here's sample test problem number seven. An ambulance travels down the highway at a speed of 75 meters miles per hour. Its siren emitting sound at a frequency of 400 hertz. What frequency is heard by a passenger in a car traveling ahead of the ambulance at 50 miles per hour in the same direction as the ambulance? All right, well, one mile per hour is one mile per hour. And let's convert that. We know there are 1,609 meters in a mile. And in one hour, there is 3,600 seconds. So, one mile per hour is equal to 0.447 meters per second. So in other words, we would convert miles per hour to meters per second by multiplying by 0.447. So, uh, 75 miles per hour times 0.447 is equal to 33.5 meters per second and 50 miles per hour times 0.447 is 22.35 meters per second. So we have an ambulance traveling down the highway with a siren and that is the source at 33.5 meters per second and then we have a car traveling ahead of the ambulance moving in the same direction as the observer at 22.35 meters per second so in this case uh, the observed frequency is the actual frequency velocity of sound plus or minus the velocity of the observer over the velocity of sound minus or plus the velocity of the source. Since the actual frequency is 400 hertz, velocity of sound is 343 meters per second. We have a plus or minus the velocity of the observer, 22.35 over velocity of sound, 343 minus or plus the velocity of the source, 33.5. Now, since it is the intent of the observer to go in this direction, which is away from the source, the observer is backing away from the source, so we're going to use the bottom minus sign for that. And since it's the intent of the source to move towards the observer, and the observer is somewhere over here, then we're going to use the top minus sign for the source. So we're going to have a minus minus here and this will give us an observed frequency of 414 Hertz. Kind of makes sense. It should be a little bit higher because all things considered the, uh, the distance between the two objects is getting shorter so that should cause the frequency on our basic intuition to go higher. All right, part B. Still have the ambulance. The car passes a stationary van on the highway. What frequency is heard by a passenger in the van? All right, so in this case, our frequency is the frequency of the source, velocity of sound plus or minus the velocity of the observer, over velocity of sound minus or plus the velocity of the source. But now the observer is a stationary van so it has no velocity so this is going to be 400 times 343 plus or minus 0 over 343 now it's still the intent of the um, source to move toward the observer so that we're going to use the minus sign here again for the top minus sign so this is equal to 443.3 hertz. So when the car passes the stationary van, 
they are at that moment at the same place in the universe at the same time but they observe different things that is really cool that they can be in the same place and the same time and observe different things and physics says that's perfectly okay <laughs>